Hi, my name is Alyssa Carter. I am the Infinity Coordinator here at the BIS Secondary School campus, and I'd like to tell you a little bit about Infinity. So asynchronous learners for us means students that have different abilities in different areas. For example, they may be completely at the same level as their like and age peers in math and science, and yet in English they're performing two to three grade levels above their like and age peers. How do we work with students that have such different abilities? These are asynchronous from the common cohort. Likewise, we have some students that are working several years above their like and age peers in multiple areas. How do we cater for students like these? So the Infinity program actually has three different areas that we're focusing in on. Um, the first is passion project, where we are helping develop passions in students and helping students not only discover but continue to work within their passions. We also have uh, professional development for teachers to help improve and develop their skills when working with students that have asynchronous needs. Um, and we also have the Pathways program, which is a program that provides more student voice choice in, within their own curriculum. So the students co-determine the curriculum with the teachers. Asynchronous students, just like students from any other subgroup, come with additional needs, come with additional um, characteristics that must be addressed. Uh, some of our students have really a lot of difficulty with socializing um, with students in their like and age group. Some students have difficulty being understood. Their thoughts are so deep and so wonderful. They can't really communicate that out to others. Maybe they don't have that ability yet. Maybe um, they, they don't have the words in order to communicate that. So as Infinity, we work with these students to provide a safe place where they can express themselves and where they get the skills that they need, both socially and through communication, in order to express their ideas and thoughts to others. As a student, I also had really strong abilities in school and was placed in a lot of advanced classes um, throughout my education in the U.S. Um, and yet, in some areas, I was still kind of an immature child growing up. So it was that, that, that misnomer, that, that misdirection of, okay, how do we deal with this somewhat immature girl going through school who's able to work three to four grade levels above where she should be? Um, and really understanding the whole child and catering to the whole child's need. This program, although it is designed for students with asynchronous abilities, is fully inclusive. We do not only cater to students with exceptional abilities. There are a lot of students that are exceptionally motivated. We have students that want to go out and be astronauts. And if they want to go out and be astronauts, then they take some of the ASAs, like math explorers, that go into other more advanced mathematical concepts. They learn some of the skills. They, they do many of the activities that the students who may have asynchronous abilities do because of their motivation. We want students that are highly motivated. We want students that are asynchronous, which is why I say this is a program for the passionately curious. I have always been passionate about meeting the needs of all learners, whether the students are struggling or whether they're sailing by and they need additional challenge. I think that every student deserves the best education that we can provide. That's a little bit about the Infinity program. I would encourage you to explore other things that BIS has to offer.